Hello everybody, welcome back to youtube.com slash geekloud. For those of you following along at home with the Monday Night Gaming Enforcement Agency, you'll know I recently got this steering wheel uh, mount for this, the frame, if you will, for the steering wheel. So I thought, what better way to uh, enjoy it than by installing Lawn Simulator, available through Xbox Game Pass. And yes, it has been optimised for the Xbox Series S and X. So hopefully... We're in for a good time here with the lawn mowing simulator. Oh, yes, just install it wherever there's space, please, Xbox. You know what's going on. All right, here it is, lawn mowing simulator, and that's coming in at a total of 17.14 gigabytes. As I was saying earlier, we do gaming enforcement agencies Monday nights right here on Geek Aloud, 8 p.m. ish. It's uh, myself, Troy, with Steve, Uncle Dunky, going over the games we've played this week and the games that will be coming out next week. So you can be bet your bottom dollar that we will be talking about Lawn Mowing Simulator tomorrow night on Gaming Enforcement Agency. It'd be great to see you along. Why don't you come on by? I'll tell you how we go with the. Uh, expert frame and the steering wheel lawn mowing simulator available now through xbox game pass let's install
installed lawn mowing simulator. All right, let's fire it up. Check out that main menu. See if there's any extra bits we need to download. Maybe there's a campaign. Maybe there's multiplayer. Maybe there's some sort of zombies horde mode. Maybe a crazy Dave mode. Do we need a taco in here? Possibly. I'm not sure if there's tombstones. Would a graveyard be like the highest level of lawn mowing? you think that would be stadiums. Surely sports stadiums are where this ultimately ends up. Surely you end up mowing the G or something. Pressing any button, it's not looking good for the controller. I'm pressing any button there. That's not good. I don't think it's supported. Turn on the uh, standard controller. Press a button and sign in. I don't think the controller's supported. How disappointing. We'll check though, we'll check. It could still come up in a menu. Oh yeah, sync that data. My long history of uh, lawn mowing needs to be accounted for. Wow, that is loud. All right, new slot one. Oh, it's a career. Well, sure, we'll play with the tutorials. What we want to do is, uh, you know, what we just want to do is see the controller is what we're looking for. Controller, free mode. Surely I want to go for a free mode. We just... <laughs> I have no idea. And if it doesn't work with the steering wheel, what a complete bust. Oh, look. Oh, I see the problem. We're walking around. Maybe once we're on the lawnmower, maybe then we can... Uh... All right. Now we're on hold X to start engine. Is it going to work? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, it does work. It does work! Oh, happy days! <laughs> uh, perfect, it works! <laughs> All right, let's bring up those particulars. Whoa, what an emotional roller coaster this Let's Install has been. My goodness! Oh, worth persevering though, wasn't it? All right, there we have it. Lawnmower Simulator, now available at Xbox Game Pass, optimized for the X and X, and does work with the Logitech G270 or something. Installed successfully. Thank you very much for watching this now. Be sure to tune in on Monday night, 8 p.m.-ish, for my full thoughts of Lawn Mowing Simulator on the Gaming Enforcement Agency. That's with me and Steve right here, Monday nights, 8 o'clock. Make sure you like it and subscribe it, and you'll never miss it. Everything about it. Ooh. <laughs> 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 Old Uncle Donkey. <laughs> <laughs> <G> Donkey. <laughs>